In this video, I'm going to show you how Gucci or So Not Gucci ran the best offense in Madden 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch today's video. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, basically what I do on YouTube is I try to help you get better um, at basically Madden on both the offensive side of the ball and on the defensive side of the ball through doing tips and tricks every single day, um, videos that are breaking down both pro players, and I also share some of my own uh, spins on those things as well and different concepts that I've created as well. So. I uh, just want to encourage you to go ahead and click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. I post about eight tip videos every single day on YouTube. So if you want to get access to the latest uh, strategies and breakdowns, um, that's the best way to do it. So, um, so not Gucci. I thought this guy was one of the best players that nobody had really ever heard of um, coming into this game. I think that um, he really, you know, one of the things that he said was to put some respect on his name, and I think he definitely earned that um, with his performance. A lot of people respect Manu as one of the top defensive minds um, in competitive Madden, and what we were able to consistently see was that um, so not Gucci played phenomenal phenomenal on the offensive side of the ball and did a lot of things that were I felt like not necessarily super unique but super super effective and so we're going to dive right into uh, one of his favorite play setups that he was utilizing out of the shotgun bunch. A lot of people have been going to this, and I think if I remember correctly, he was running the New York Jets uh, offensive playbook. So we're just going to break down kind of a couple of his route combinations, two in particular plays that I think is going to be really effective. And if you want to get my full gun bunch offensive scheme, you can shoot me a text message. My number will be in the top left-hand corner of your screen. All right, guys, so two of the top setups that I saw him using, one, the first one was out of, or both were out of Gun Bunch, but the first one was the Z-Spot play, and the second one was the Flood play. So we're going to go over both of those. I got them in my audibles right here, but we're going to first start... Um, and we're just going to come out in Jets dig. This was this Jets dig. I think he could have ran that a little bit more, um, but that's more of a cover three beater, which we'll go over uh, maybe in a later video. But anyways. The first play that we're going to use is the play that he ran the most, um, and that's the Z-Spot play. Now, the reason why he ran this so frequently is because he had Randy Moss, and I believe he had Route Technician on him, um, but I also know that Randy Moss has over 90 deep route running. When you have over 90 deep route running on a receiver and you run a corner route like this one, when you smart route the corner route, it basically turns into um, essentially a really sharp cutting slant out almost. And so um, that was what he was doing. He was smart routing this corner route. The next thing he would do is he would have Antonio Brown here, this outside receiver in the bunch, on a little out route in case you know he needed something to pull the zones um, outside. He would typically streak his tight end, and then normally he actually blocks his running back a lot, and then basically drag uh, Mike Evans. Now Mike Evans, unfortunately we don't have this example in practice mode, but that would be the out of position Deion Sanders. And the reason that's important is because the out of position Deion Sanders has the playmaker ability. So that drag, he could playmaker it up, he could playmaker it back what, to the back side of the formation, could do whatever he wanted with it. But anyways, um, this, is, this is kind of the base setup, so I'll show you what this looks like. This is first and foremost against man coverage, and you see the kind of separation that Chris Godwin will get on this, and this is because he has slotomatic, but if you have route tech or slotomatic or something like that, that's going to make this route even better. And what's really cool about this is this route does a really good job against pretty much every zone of the game as well. So essentially, it's a it's a nice route to have against man, but it's also a nice route to have against zone. And you can't use her both. You can't use her the corner route and the drag. And this was kind of the dilemma that he was able to put a lot of people in. As you see here, this thing gets super super open, and we saw a lot of those throws uh, in his game against Manu. Now, like I said, if you want to get um, my full Gun Bunch offense, it's in my text membership. For those of you that don't know what my text membership is, basically what my text membership is, is it's a free way that I can give you guys uh, full offenses and full defenses. So every single week, typically on Fridays or Saturdays, I'll sit down and record about an hour to an hour and a half um, of an offensive scheme or defensive scheme that I think is really, really uh, good. In the last video we did was the trips tied in, but we've also done in the past the bunch offset the bunch the big nickel over g the nickel 335 wide a lot of the high level schemes we've broken down in this playlist for you so all you have to do is shoot me a text message and you'll get access to the entire uh library the entire playlist we got about 12 videos in there with about um 15 hours of video content but anyways guys that is um that's the first way that he would run his his game plan the second play that he ran that i thought was really really effective was the play flood 
And he actually ran this a little bit differently than most people, at least than a lot of people that I had seen. Um, and it's because he had a hot route master ability on his quarterback. So a lot of people in Mutt are running with the Rich Gannon. He's definitely the best quarterback in Mutt right now. And so uh, Sona Gucci would use this setup as well to kind of counter, um, really to kind of counter um, his setup out of the, the curl flat play. And this is how he would do it. Uh, the first thing that he would typically do is he would take Mike Evans and he would put him on a post route and he would smart route the route. Um, the reason that these smart routed post routes work really well is they get really good separation against man coverage to the inside. The next thing that he would do is he would take his running back and just put him on a little table route. And then you often saw this little kind of motion that was kind of the John Beast uh, motion of the tournament. But as you can see here, if it's man coverage, he's going to be able to hit this out or this um, this post route to Mike Evans. The other route that he's going to be able to hit, um, if it's a man coverage situation, is he's going to typically be able to hit his uh, his slot receiver right here, Chris Godwin. You see that he's going to get really nice separation against man-to-man -man coverage as well. And then if they take the safety away, which is very common, right, very common to take the safety away in man-to-man -man coverage this year, you'll see a lot of this right here. You'll see this, this kind of purple zone type of deal where they have maybe 25-yard purples or something like that. Well, then that's where this would be really effective. You just motion this out. You see here he gets the inside position, and then you can basically throw that with the pass lead to the inside. And if there's no safety there, that could be a one-play touchdown. So that's a little bit about how he ran the best gun bunch. Really his favorite play, and, and that's where, I mean, just from my research on him and what I saw, what I thought really what he brought to the table from this was this Z spot setup, and I know that he's not the first person to run this, but this setup right here is one of the best setups in the game. Um, it's just really hard. This corner route is really, really good. Um, as you can see right there, I mean, it just gets such good separation. So you can do this out of other sets that have corner routes like this. You see people from trips tied in do this out of the play curl flat um, or level sale, so or doubles in sale. But anyways, that is how Sonat Gucci ran the best offense in Madden 21. And if you want to get the full gun bunch scheme, go ahead and shoot me a text message. My number is 812-216-3644. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will be live tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time answering your questions and playing Madden with the subscribers. So be sure to come hang out with us on stream and just talk Madden together. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you guys tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time.